Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. You can also set the allow zero length property for a field to either yes or no, to either require data entry in the field to be of a length greater than zero, basically not allowing things like spacebar values or the values entered when you hit tab on your keyboard, and this is handy for those times when you do want people to have to enter a value into the field, but you also don't want it to be the empty set or invisible characters. In this case, you would change allow zero length to no. Disallowing zero length entries in the string. It's often used in tandem with the required property. So you might set required to yes to require data entry and choose allow zero length and set that to no to disallow zero length entries in that field. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.